Hi there, many others like you have asked. Should a Christian celebrate Father's Day? Let's find out, shall we? You can discover more answers on gotquestions.org. Father's Day is a day set apart to celebrate fatherhood, recognize the influence of fathers in our homes and society, and foster paternal bonds. It's also celebrated to honor and commemorate our fathers and forefathers. While it is celebrated in the U.S. on the third Sunday of June, in many other countries the officially recognized date of Father's Day varies. It is believed that Father's Day was first observed on June 19, 1910 in Spokane, Washington through the efforts of Sonora Smart Dodd, a Christian woman and the daughter of American Civil War veteran William Jackson Smart. Sonora wanted a day that would commemorate and honor fathers like her own, who had raised her and five other children. Once she began soliciting the idea of an official Father's Day, she met some opposition and even derision, but she persevered. A bill was introduced in Congress in 1913, and in 1916, President Woodrow Wilson wanted to make it an official holiday, but Congress still resisted. In 1924, Calvin Coolidge became involved, and in 1930, a national committee was formed by various trade groups in an effort to legitimize the holiday. The battle continued, and in 1966, President Lyndon Johnson made a proclamation for the third Sunday of June to be Father's Day. Finally, it was made an official national holiday when President Nixon signed a similar proclamation in 1972. While God's Word is silent about any day being set aside specifically to honor fathers, the Bible does recognize a special place of honor for men who were leaders or examples of excellence in certain skills. Jabel was the father of those who live in tents and raise livestock, and his brother Jubal was the father of all who play the harp and flute. Also, when Abram's name was changed to Abraham, God told him, I have made you a father of many nations, clearly indicating fatherhood as a place of honor in his eyes. Even though the Bible does not mention a Father's Day, we can clearly see that God does recognize the importance of fathers and even gave them special honor throughout history. Furthermore, we can follow the fatherhood theme in the very person of God himself through countless scriptures. Jesus Christ, the Son, honored his Father and honored the will of his Father. Apostle Paul reminds us that we should honor your father and mother, which is the first commandment with a promise that it may go well with you and that you may enjoy long life on the earth. In conclusion, it would seem to be perfectly God-honoring to celebrate a day in which fathers the God-given spiritual head of the family could and should be honored. Ultimately, as a matter of personal preference, we have the freedom to celebrate or not to celebrate this holiday. All right, that answers your question. Should a Christian celebrate Father's Day?